Hi guys. Can you hear me? I'm back. Let me. No, I need to. Let me. Let me paste. I'm back. Yes, guys, um, I'm sorry. <laughs> it's kind of funny what happened, but <laughs> I'm going to tell you guys, <laughs> my little kid, <laughs> she was, <laughs> she was <laughs> messing with, with the wires and she disconnected my computer. <laughs> it's funny. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> kind of a <laughs> Okay. Uh, yeah, <laughs> seriously, my temper, <laughs> funny thing, yeah, that's why I should, <laughs> I should stream from my notebook, but I'm using my desktop now, um, so, um, okay, picking up, picking up from where we left here, I was talking about this expanded, um, uh, expanded correction here right we have this one two three four five finishing here oh damn here here is our um a we have finished this a here then we are now going up for this b okay not now because we need to correct this this a here we are still correcting it and the way that I label it, we have this X, okay, it's a failed, a failed impulse wave here, okay, a failed motive impulse wave here, okay, and then we're gonna have this X, and then we're gonna go up, A, B, C, for this Y, this Y here, um, this Y here, what is it, it's gonna be our B of a higher degree. Here, B of a higher degree, like here, okay, which is this one here. This is the B of a higher degree. Um, this is what's going to happen if, in my opinion, right, if we have this correction here and it's correct, right? Like I said, just let me remind you guys, uh, I do think that we have something like this happening, okay, something like this that happened with silver, okay. It just took years to correct, but of course, in crypto, things are not that, that doesn't take that long. But nevertheless, we have this uh, strong impulse wave here. There's a strong parabolic movement here, and now we are correcting. We have a flat correction like we have here. It's a nine wave triangle, okay? It's forming a falling edge. It's in long term, of course, this is a, a bullish pattern anyway yeah but this is not going to this 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 has correct a lot this has correct the price here now we need to correct the time we need time for it to finish like uh, in my other stream when I was streaming and then <laughs> it disconnected I explained that we have an ABCDE and then we can have an ABCDE inside of E that's what's going to happen here at least if we are to spend more time in this correction okay a b c d e now we would need to finish this b here okay so again what we need to pay attention short term are we gonna break this resistance here this black box here that i have drawn here this is a pretty strong resistance yeah we have tried here once twice Third, three times here, but without uh, without even <laughs> success. We have tried it, and then we have just uh, react to it. Okay, 
and this was an area of, of uh, if we go back, it was an area that it was like uh, it, 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 it was a support, but it's now a resistance. It has been a resistance since June, right? Since beginning of June. So, are we gonna break it now? I don't think. I don't think so. Not now. We need a bit of a buyer support. We need to to go down again, okay? To have some uh, buy strength to go up, to add to the to to the buyer some full, and then we would go up, okay? But I might be wrong, guys. It might go higher but it might go higher and we have a b here same thing yeah we might go but we, waves b can extend and go higher than the the beginning of wave a okay it might it, it's gonna be expand an expanded uh correction here an, an expanded a b c then we might have a d e it's gonna be an expanded triangle much more like this pattern here that we have. I'm gonna I, I, I'm gonna start using the book to show you guys, so then you can learn this thing here. Okay, you see that we have A here. If B goes beyond the, the beginning of the A, we have an expanding triangle. Okay, something like this. It 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 might happen. Okay, it's not impossible. It's with it's within the principle. Okay, of Elliott waves. Um, what I think is gonna happen just because we have uh, a really let me see four hours we have uh, pretty much oversold we have an oversold four hours here we have a little bit of room because we have already got to this really high RSI zones I don't think we are gonna have we are gonna try to break this this resistance not yet okay so then um, in my, the way I count it, the way I labeled it, we have a C here that's finishing, or it has finished, uh, and then we are going down A, B, C, I'm sorry, 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, C to finish this X. This whole structure here, A, B, C, is our X. If and only if we fail to break this lowest low, okay? This is my setup, by the way. This is what I'm going to do. I'm going to start. I am in a short. I am laddering shorts here. If it goes up, I'm gonna add more to my short. And if it goes down, I'm gonna add more to my short with strength. Okay, to help the 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 the, the wave go down. Okay. <clears throat> what what happens after we we get to this point here? This C that it, it doesn't need exactly. To even touch this lowest low, well, we, we might have a C that's like this. Okay, it's let, let's just let's just measure. Okay, if we have finished B here, uh, let me just take this A. Uh, let's just see. Let me let's us let's use the fib extension here. Okay, this is the beginning of our A, the end of our A, and then our B here because this is the beginning of the, the end of B allegedly right it's not oh my goodness this okay this is the end of B okay then oh nice isn't it see we have 100% of extension here at minus 33 60 percent and I'll go target okay nice Beautiful. We have this whole box of extension here. If we have this as an A, B, we extend it using the FIB extension. Look at the confluence that we have here, guys. Minus 33, 20%, right? Almost not touching the, the, the lowest low of the year. Okay, so I would like to... Let me get a, a, a green box here. And I would like to highlight this region here, guys. Okay, this region, not even touching the the lowest low of the year. Yeah, not even touch that huge resistance. I'm sorry, that huge support. See, uh, here we have the extend uh, A extended to B. We have this 100, 127, 20. Yes, it might go lower, and we might go lower. I think challenging the the 
the support, the lowest low of the year, and we might still have an X, okay? What might, what would invalidate this, uh, this as an X? The way I put it here, okay? The way I put it here is if we have a structure like this, a strong selling pressure, okay? Again, I will need to relabel this. Bear in mind that I know that this might go, that might go to minus 100% here, okay? We'll have something like this, okay? I, I This is not my primary count, not yet, but I, I am taking into account that this might happen. But this is a really nice confluence, isn't it? Um, okay, I Templar, what happens to the structure if you break out of the inverted head and shoulder? How would you label it? The head and shoulder. Uh, wait a second. Okay, I'm I'm gonna I'm gonna see that head and shoulder in a second. Uh, I am focusing on this this short term pattern here because come on, right? It's important that we decide what's gonna happen now, and what's gonna happen now. It's pretty clear, at least the way I label it. It's we have a B here, we are finishing the C, and we are going down to to challenge these regions here, right? Minus 33, 60 percent is an algo target. Whomever bought here at 50 percent, it's an easy target here. Minus 36. Whoever so, sold here, sorry, whoever, whoever sold here, 50 percent is gonna buy here again at minus 33, 60 percent, minus 38, 20 percent. Okay. Strong confluence here, guys. Strong. Okay. And then we would go up. Yes. Why we would go up? Is, is this a bullish trend? Is this a, a, a trend reversal? No. This is part of the whole correction that we are correcting here. This whole structure, as I said. Okay. This is the one, two, three, four, five. This is the motive impulse wave down. And we are correcting now. But this is a complex correction. Okay. It's a expanded correction. Okay, it's a W, X, Y. We are not here. We are not going to finish here and go up. No, it would go down. Okay, what is this Y here when we go up? This is the B higher degree here. This B here. After this B, we would indeed have an A, B, C going down here for our C. Okay, this is what would happen. This would have another... Uh, another downtrend another selling pressure here to, to perhaps uh have an another another touch of this uh, lower lowest low here but perhaps going down here again and have an uh, touching the support again but going up or breaking it okay it's a possibility okay don't forget this picture this is the the whole picture of Bitcoin daily, it's important to keep in mind that we have time, that it's, it, it's, there, there is a lot of time yet for us to, perhaps the whole year. I am, I am saying that, I might be wrong, of course, it might, it might end sooner than, than I think, but I doubt it. <clears throat> um, so. And then that's that's for the short term here. What I think is gonna happen is we're gonna correct this, okay? The, uh, finish this ABC. So going to the C here, we have a confluence, like I said, and then we would then we will go up to this B of a higher degree, okay? Um, I temper asked here about the head and shoulder. What he is talking about is this head and shoulder here. This pattern here, right? That I I am aware of. Wait a sec. Oh my goodness. This pattern here, let me show you guys. This is a four hour chart, okay? It's pretty clear that we have a, a, a left shoulder here. I am I marked here the left shoulder, okay? Here we have the 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 head, okay? Well, here I have this line, I'm gonna this out yes and we have here the cmf okay showing us uh, showing us the 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 volume of sellers decreasing yes hmm so let me put daily because uh, yes daily perfect here 
Yes. Here we have the neckline. The neckline is that uh, that six eight hundred fifty resistance. Okay. Here we have our left shoulder. Here is the the. Let me draw the head and shoulder, right? Why not? Here is our left shoulder. Black line head here, and then we would go here, and we would have this one here. This would be our inverted head and shoulder, right? Which is a bullish pattern. Yeah. Let me put the EMA. Let's just to see. Yeah. We have now daily, it's not finished our daily, but we are now challenge the 21 EMA. Okay, this is the daily. And we have this, indeed. <sighs> if we go to this 6150, okay, this is the neckline. Blue here, the neckline. If we touch this neckline, this is 6850. This that that really that really uh, old, not old, rather old resistance. Okay, which is going to be our 50, which is going to be our 55 EMA here. We are gonna need to challenge the resistance and the 55 EMA. We need to go and break it. If we go and break it, hmm. Yes, it. it it might means that we th this pattern is in play is gonna be in play uh, and we have a different count you see we will have a, a truncated fifth wave here a three fifth truncated fifth wave and then we would go perhaps have a i would need to recount it i would need to recount my my short term count okay let me because what we have is that we are going to get the, the size of the head here from the neckline to the head and we would go up like this, okay? This would take us to the 8K region. If, guys, and only if, we have this pattern, this this head and sh inverted head and shoulder, okay? Then you would do like, if you want to go long here, is like this, okay? put really a tight stop loss okay at the sixth I, I would be really crazy I would put my, my I would start laddering laddering of course I would do that I would start laddering longs at 6900 because then we would break it we would have broken the the resistance the resistance in the 55 EMA and I would put my stop loss at 67 six seven hundred fifty and this is a risk reward of six forty four uh, i think it's a good risk reward let me just take this a little bit like this a sixth uh a six risk a six to one risk reward right then i would of course i would play it at, at the breakout but i wouldn't depend on this pattern i templar I wouldn't depend on this. Uh, I, I, we need to be realistic. We need to, of course, uh, understand that we might have this pattern here. I, I see some buying pressure here at the CMF. I, I, I do like this. I would love to see this pattern. Well, it's a uh, guarantee money. Yeah, you go long here. It's a. Uh, it's just the size of the head. It's it's uh, the target for us here. Hmm. It's a one possibility. Why not? Okay. But the way that I see here, okay, what would happen? That would happen that we would go to the B anyways. Okay. We wouldn't have the B here anyways. What this thing here, this head and shoulder pattern, would bring us this B sooner. Okay. We would have like you see. A, B, and we, we would have a really long C to complete this B. Okay, that's what would happen in the short term. If we have this inverted head and shoulder, and if it really happens, okay. Um, this would, I would need to rethink this thing. Okay, I would need to, I would need to label this thing as a five, of, as a fifth. I will need to put my fifth wave here and truncate a fifth. I don't like to assume it. 
Why? Because this would be a truncated fifth. It's it's fine. If this would be a fourth wave of this whole degree here, and we would have finished the fifth wave here, and we would go up. Okay, this would be a, an impulse wave to finish the C, the one, two, three, four, five of um, we would have actually a A B C, right? To finish this, to put in this B here. Is is if it is, if is that what you are asking? Right, we would need to change it. Put this five here. Would have a truncated fifth. Yes, that just like I I, I I label it there, right? I label it here. See, a truncated fifth wave. If we have this, we would have a truncated fifth wave. We would have a three here instead of a five. We would have a one, two, three, a long three. But the fifth would fail to go lower than the the three. And we will have a truncated fifth wave. In this case, the four would be here, the fifth would be would be here, and we would go up. Would need to correct this movement. It would be the same. We would correct, but we would start the correction now, and we would go higher to correct this whole this whole downtrend here, this whole motive impulse wave down. If and only if this. Inverted head and shoulder is really indeed uh, the pattern that we have. Okay, so yes, it's possible. I'm sorry, it's likely that we have this. But it's also likely that we have this. Okay? I like to present more than one scenario, guys. Okay. Um, this is this is a this is also a good scenario. But then you then you ask me, but if I play like this and I short here and then I go and then Bitcoin goes up, what? Then I lose money. No, you need to know how to put your stop losses. And in, in this case, I, I you need to put your stop losses. Uh, if it if it start going going up against you, okay. If it's, if you're shorting and it starts going really high, you need to just to stop your loss. Okay, you stop your loss and then you consider entering a different, a different, uh, entering along here. You start laddering longs here to perhaps get this breakout here in this inverted hand and shoulder. Okay, you need to change. You need to be reactive to the market, not passive, and wait for the market to do what you want, whatever you, you think that's the correct count or whatever you think is the the right thing that the market should do it's the opposite you need to react to the market okay uh, the EMA shows one hour charts shows pretty bullish scenario right we have we have broke all the uh, the EMAs and they have crossed but this this does does not tell us a lot okay but bear in mind, bear in mind that we might indeed face the, let's, let's see, yes, we, we have the 21 here acting as support. The 21 hasn't, uh, hasn't crossed the, the 55 and the 100. If it cross, it's a bullish scenario. It's a bullish sign of a, of a, that might, we might have that inverted head and shoulder yeah hmm. it's nice but this is one hour okay let's see the four hour how is it yes we are we have we we have breached the 200 dma but now we are we are retracing to it you see but we it's uh the buyers are defending the 200 dma hmm nice so Keep in mind, if you are, I am shorting, I am in a position, that I am shorting now. Uh, I am considering adding more, but I, I, I am like, I have 10% of my position in a short now. Okay. But it's not going to be, I am going to stop it right if I see uh, bullish signs that this is not really what I, uh, what I have here. That what we have indeed is is a movement upwards and that we what we have is more like this 
than the other one. Yeah? If we have something like this, fourth and the fifth here, a truncated fifth, and we start going up, of course, I'm gonna consider that this is the count, okay? I'm gonna consider this is the count, this is the count, and then we are going up to finish this B here, okay? What do you guys think? Do you, ha do you guys have questions? Do you guys have a, a chart that you would, would like me to take a look at? Some different ideas? I Templar, uh, did I answer your question? I think it was what you, uh, I think I, I cover it, right? Um, I'm waiting for questions. If you guys have questions, uh, if you guys have shorts, if you guys disagree with me and would like to present a different count or a different idea, can you take a look at ICX and see if there's any hope soon? Yes, <laughs> any hope soon. Uh, let me see where I have a... Oh, this is my bullish count for Bitcoin. <laughs> but this is doesn't make any sense, okay? N any sense. At least from a perspective that it got invalidated here on Bitstamp. So, this is, this is just, ju it's, it's just here, just... I don't know why. <laughs> Uh, this is US. Let me use this short here. Okay. Oh, by the way, US is a nice short as well. At least the way I see it. Let me see ICX icon. Binance, right? Hmm. Mm hmm. Hmm. Uh. Daily, the process, yeah. Daily, oh, pretty much this parabolic. This is a sharp correction. Come on, huh? oh yeah, but it got listed when 2008. There, right? 2008. Here we don't have enough data to consider it. We have a one, two, three, three. One, two. Let Let's measure it, I Templar. Okay, to see if we, we. This is icon. Let's uh, first see the EMA, okay? Okay, the EMA, four hours. Huh. We have the 21 acting as a support now, okay? It started, we see some turning, but we see a crossing here at the, at the MACD, but I don't think this, this is going to last long. I think we're gonna see something like this for Icon, okay? Because it's getting to the top of it, right? Like trading views or discords. Uh, yes, I have my 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 Twitch, my Twitch, my Twitter. This is my Twitter. Okay, and you and I have my YouTube channel. Please considering joining me there. My YouTube channel is this one here. If you want, let me just copy it here and posting it here right why not there it is guys uh, I'm sorry I Templar let me see here again so we have this um, 21 support 21 EMA support acting as a support but as Bitcoin has moved up of course we're gonna see some kind of uh, of movement but the count for this is basically what I see is that I see a one, two, three, four, five. I see a one, two, three. I, I see a motive wave down. Okay, and it hasn't finished. One, this is a clear two. Let, let's count, okay, together as an exercise. Let's see this one, two. Mm, which one is a three? This is a three. Four. Mm. Let's, let's measure to see if it's correct. Let's see the, the desired point for... Mm. 
Beautiful. Yes, this is that. There is a tree. Yeah. Um. Let me put the tree here. Yes, this is the tree. Yeah, but the four. And here we have. Let me check. I don't know man, gotta tell you that, let me change this to a higher degree, oops, my count to a higher degree, uh, not super micro, so we knew that, uh, one, two, three, okay, this is the desired spot, 106.8, okay, touched it, and we traced, this is not a really good well, ABC, this is not uh, the personality of a wave 4, but then we touch the 100 DMA and we, tra we, we continued going down. It's pretty clear for me. Let's now count here inside of a... One, two, this is three, four, and five. Yes. Definitely is going down. It's going down, I Templar. I don't see it, 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 it stopping here, okay? I don't see it like, uh, it's difficult to tell, but like I said, if Bitcoin is going down, hmm. you see, one, two, inside of five, this is five within five, okay? Let's measure it, as always, it's important, yeah? Let's see, this is the my one, two, One, two. Yes. Hmm. Yes, I think that we haven't finished the tree. You see, actually, we have touched the tree here. It's a, and then we are putting our four. So you have some uh, some retracement happening here. Yeah? We are cor This is the tree. Uh, okay. This is our one, two, three. Okay four then we are one two three this is a one two then we need to count here i wanted to put in a lower degree then we have our four okay this is going up a bit and then our five to finish the five within five let me put a lower degree here okay La micro okay got gotcha. it yeah oh, i'm sorry let me let me measure this four because we had a we had a really shallow too, we might have a, a, a deeper four. Okay, if Bitcoin goes up, of course. Okay, this is the oh damn it, thirty three, thirty three twenty percent. Okay, retracement. If we go, uh, this is the region. Okay, let me mark it for you. No, not this. Let me mark it. This would be the short, okay? 3820, of course, we can go higher and have 50% um, retracement. We can go to this region here, okay? And then f the last wave, right? It can't, it, and, and what is interesting is that we have those two Argo targets here, minus 2360, minus 3320%. So those are the, the regions right then i would take a look at at least the way i see it okay this is icon the way i count it okay i i, I just counted with you guys right now on fly one two three four five this is the last wave i don't know exactly uh, we have some interest here you see this is our vol volume profile i see some selling buying interest here I would pay attention at this region, you see? This region here where I put my I, I haven't I haven't taken a look before. I, I'm looking at it right now. We have some interest here. So it's a nice place for us to think about the four here and then we are going down to finish our five. So we might not have this, okay? We might have a little bit more of a 
of a of a movement up like this okay and then we go down just following Bitcoin okay just following just ah, but Bitcoin is going down nah. it's gonna be difficult yeah but it, it doesn't need to act to follow Bitcoin exactly but if Bitcoin crashes you might see just a, a shallow retracement here and then it would go down again okay bear in mind that of course Bitcoin is always dictating the movements of of uh, altcoins like this so hmm. um, guys more shorts uh, requests questions um, feedbacks whatever if you guys have an idea different counts different ideas um, I'm trying to present as always a really a really uh, overall picture and giving different counts and uh, and present you guys probabilities of what might happen okay Otherwise, if you guys don't have questions, I would wrap up here now, and I would like to to see what we, how the day is gonna unfold, right? Because it's gonna be a really nice. It's gonna be a really nice day for us if we take a close look at what's going to happen with Bitcoin. It's nice if we just pay attention at how this thing is gonna play it's retracing you see but it's it, this might be the four of a five so remains to be seen i would be really cautious at entering a position right now but i am shorting like i said i am shorting because this is how i see that bitcoin is gonna play okay if you guys haven't seen my whole stream i'm gonna post on my youtube channel okay and then you can I'm gonna post, yes, Vita Vinci, I'm gonna post on YouTube, okay? And then you guys can watch it, okay? And if you guys want me to take a look at different charts, uh, send me, I, uh, please write on the comments on YouTube. Then next, and then tomorrow, I can take a look at the, at the charts that you have requested, okay? This is going to be easier for me, easier for you. I can take a look at the charts and and have some different ideas, have different counts, and that's it. Okay. Have a wonderful day, a wonderful day, guys. And what the, I try to say, have a wonderful day, and I said, have a have a, have a wonderful day. <laughs> okay, doesn't matter, right? <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. <laughs> have, a, have a wonderful day and we see each other next one. <laughs> Cheers. Bye bye.